Hello, Clyseer, this game, and by that I mean Link to the Past. Um, still with the not getting stuff, and you know. Um, we're back in level 3, because we're on our way out, because I started from saved place instead of from the pyramid, because I believe this is closer to dungeon 4 than the pyramid is. Yeah, one thing that would have been good to do before going in the dungeon, if, you know, I was actually getting stuff, would be to get half magic. Um, it's an upgrade that makes all your magic cost half. <laughs> oh, man. Um, also, one thing I didn't point out last time is one of these rocks was shiny when I walked by here. It's a GBA thing. You can, like, attack the rock and rupees come out. Um, so yeah, this place. Off to the left somewhere, there's like a, um, oh, what's it called? A thing. Where you can do things. Oh, a mini game. You like pay some money and open a couple boxes, and you can get a heart piece there. Lower right of town is where the, um, uh, smithy is in the light world. And you can't actually get your sword upgraded until you find the other one, which is below the main town area, but you need, um, level 3 gloves before you can do anything about it. Where am I going? Is this the right way? I think that box is the map, but I think, um, I'm close to where I'm supposed to be still. No, it's the compass! I am always mixing up my completely worthless items. Yeah. Oh, big key. I thought it was a little key. Anyway. Um, yeah, so I changed the border. Um, that's exciting, right? Um, I hope the gameplay is at least exciting, because, um, I don't have many hit points, and that should automatically be exciting. I also don't know where I'm going, though, and watching people be lost isn't very exciting, so I don't know. I don't think bombing that is actually worth anything. Oh, I'm a bunny! Oh, that's where I need to get. Okay. And stairs. Okay. That was entirely memorized. All, all my plan, all the time. Um, Yes. Key up here. <laughs> what item do I want out? I'm still nervous about having items in the... selected thing. That almost made sense. That, um, would be bad if I used. Selected thing. That's really what I'm saying. Yeah, you can only hit the, um bright red thing when it's not in the cloud, but both of them hurt you. It's pretty great. I wish I had magic powder. <sighs> and I wish I had a lot of things. Oh, that's why I hit the crystal switch. I was like, maybe the thing I need's down here, because I knew I needed to hit that switch. Um, oh, here's another place in the game where you absolutely have to have a bomb. They give you some in this chest, though. Man, I'm awful at this game. Why am I missing three hit points? There's, like, no reason to ever get hit. Um, da -da. Get my bomb back, because I'm never coming back here, so the other two are less wasted than they would be? Um... <laughs> sure... Um... I think that switch drops snakes on you. Or maybe drops that enemy type that was in the hallway. I do believe I need to switch the other way. And if I'm wrong, I still want it that way because it's easier to cross the room when it's that way, and then I can come back in and throw the pot at it again. Uh, 
Maybe I'll just slash him. I was gonna say, I could have hookshotted him while he was still under. Yeah, I do need it the other way, but I got across while all the spikes were trapped. That's why I went back up, so they'd get back trapped without me having to, like, time it or anything. Um, do, 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 Oh, Meteos, that's what that's from. <laughs> I was like, random jingles in my head. <laughs> what does this mean? That was a good game, though. You can lift this. Because it's bigger than the normal kind, it's more liftable. This makes sense. Somehow. Um, I don't know. My favorite thing to do here is actually, um... I head over... No, never mind. I'm getting ahead of myself. I need a, the key from this room. But I normally do, um... Get murdered by that guy, apparently. Nope, not even. I dodged it all. Okay, so... These are all open by having the big key, I think. Yeah, you can get this key here. I normally ignore her, but I'm not going to this time. Um, she is fast. Just saying. <laughs> um... Yeah, I would ignore her. Go over here. Get the, um... Whatever's in here. Level 3 glove. And then I would magic mirror out of the dungeon. Go get the level 3 sword. As well as, um, the fourth bottle. Because you can get that now. I think you could have gotten it before doing dungeon 3, even if you wanted. But, um, yeah, I, like, do all that. And then come back in and do the boss when I'm all powered up. See, this has like a switch. Yeah. But instead, I'm just gonna go do the boss. Lost my spell card bonus or whatever. Come on, don't you normally like transfer to the bottom about now? Yeah. Whoa. There are some projectiles here. I wish I had a better shield. That was an amazing song. Okay. Um. Man, that only took, like, eight minutes. Um... <laughs> right. I was just gonna do that dungeon in this video, but this is gonna be short. Um... I'll do the stuff with the flute. Or, ocarina. Instrument. Blue thing. Yeah, that should be good, then. Link! Thank you! Evil monsters. Bloodline. And also Ganon. And also accidentally almost not understanding. Let's see. So yeah, now that we have the level 3 gloves, we can come this way. We can um, rescue that guy. He's the other blacksmith. If you have him following you from talking to him, then um, you can... Use the magic mirror and he'll return to the light world as well. Also, um, the reason I went back up there and, uh, jumped down even though I moved the rock is I was demonstrating that, um, you can leave the town easily without your level 3 glove, but entering it, you need the glove if you want to come from that direction. Here's the flutes. Wait, did it really call it the flute? Was I right? Huh. I'm gonna have to look at the text box in editing, because I totally ignored it. 
Yeah, you can like play it for him because he said he wanted to hear it one last time and he also tells you to keep it. I don't know. I, li I like doing that. It feels like part of the quest. If you were like racing or something, you might skip it. <laughs> or if you just didn't care. What was that? I think my... No, I changed the batteries pretty recently. I might have to start using a different controller. Because I was definitely still holding down the whole time. And, well, you saw. I didn't keep moving consistently. Okay, and here we get to hear that whole flute thing again. Which I'm sure sounded pretty the first time and still sounds pretty. I always stand on the ice when I do this. I'm gonna talk over it this time because I don't care. Um, <laughs> or something like that. Okay, I guess I'm not going to talk over it because I couldn't think of anything to say. But, um, yeah. So, now I've got this. It only works in the light world. Did I use it? Oh, okay. He's coming. Um... Let's see. I wanted to go get Ether because I have a little extra time, but I don't want to, like, do the next dungeon. Dungeon rocks. I have so many hit points this time, I wouldn't even care if I got hit. And also, it's that cave on the right that you come out if you um, go through the thing, not the one on the left there. Um, I'll pretend that made sense and just go on. Of course I have the book. <laughs> I was like, wait, do I have everything I need? Wow. I jumped down that cliff while moving right, because I was just, like, barely on it when I warped. Yeah, you need both the book and the master sword to get the magic. Whoa! Um... I guess I'll cut ahead to after I'm done on the phone. Okay, Walmart Pharmacy. <laughs> right. So... Yeah. I guess I could have paused the recording, then I would also have to pause the sound recording and sync audio twice and, you know, the cut's gonna be easier. Anyway, the reason I'm coming over here is in the GBA version, once you open up this Dark World warp over that I'm headed toward, um, it adds a warp point to the bird, so I don't have to climb the mountain again. It'll save me time later when I come to do Dark World 7, which I often call Dark World 8. So if you got confused in one of my Shantae Lee's videos, um, yeah, I think that's good enough. Um, I'm gonna go through it too, just to make sure. I had Quake, which I do. I could open it up and... Do I actually have everything? No. I can't do this dungeon yet. I don't have the cane. That's all I'm missing, though, isn't it? Anyway. Demo the warp point. What? It's not there? Huh. Maybe you need to also have done the other dungeons. Oh, well. That's just kind of unfortunate. Um, right. So... See you next time. <laughs>